In today's video, we're going to show you how we pick fresh peonies from our organic garden and make peony jelly. We're going to harvest these peonies, fresh, yummy smelling peonies. We're going to pick them and we're going to make peony jelly. We're going to pick the big ones that are already fully opened. So you just snap it right up here. Smell nice. Ah, and remember now, this is we have a completely organic yard. We yeah. have a white colored one also. We like to grab them like this and snap them off like that. It's nice and easy. So here's our bucket of peonies I brought in and I have to soak them in this bucket with water first to get all the bugs off. Here's a little ant right there. He's like, hey, which way do I go? So once you get those cleaned off, then we can do the next step. Okay, now that the peonies are done soaking, I had them in there for a couple hours, multiple rinses to get all the little bugs out, I'm going to take and peel all the flowers off and put them in my stock pot. Just, just the flowers. Mm -hmm. All the petals. Yep, and we're gonna make our tea, which is the next step out of those. Mm -hmm. We have white ones and yellow ones here. All the flower petals. Yeah. Okay, just like that. Okay, greens in there and petals in here. There's probably about six cups worth of petals in there at least. Okay, now I'm just gonna fill the kettle up with water just above the petals. That's good, you want it to be concentrated. Now I'm gonna put it on the stove top. I'm gonna bring that to a boil. When, once that's at a full boil, I'm gonna boil it for a solid 10 minutes. Okay, after a 10 minute solid boil, I'm just gonna put the lid on that and set that aside and let it steep overnight. Okay, now it's the next morning. And this has steeped overnight. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take a towel and I'll place it over my bowl. And I'm gonna pour all of this right over the top of that and strain it. juices out of it. So there's all of our tea and here's the pulp that we're left over with. Kind of looks like wet paper. Okay, I'm going to measure this out now. There's four. I'm going to stop at a solid eight cups of peony tea. Okay, I'm going to add eight cups of sugar. And I have lime juice, but you could use, this is key lime juice, you could use lime juice or lemon juice. Either way, it doesn't matter. I'm going to add two tablespoons of lime juice. And then I'll mix that and bring that to a full boil. Okay, I have a full boil now on my peony tea with the sugar and the lime juice. Now I'm going to add eight tablespoons of pectin. And I prefer to use classic pectin. I'll mix that up and I'll bring that to a full boil again. And I'm going to boil this for 10 minutes. Okay, that was a 10 minute boil. Now I'm gonna shut my stove top off. 
and then I'll skim off any gunk that's on top of that. And then here I have a fresh water bath going for the mason jars. All right, I like to fill my measuring jar up with my jelly. That way it's easier to pour that into my mason jars over here. So we have six jars of peony jelly. So I'm gonna just give them a quick wipe around the edge. I'll put the seals on and tighten those up. And then we'll put those in the water bath and boil them for 10 minutes. And we'll dunk those. All right, 10 minutes has just passed in the water boil, so let's pull those out. Check out that color, that is so pretty. All right, we'll let those cool down before we do a yummy taste test. Time for taste testing. Time for taste testing. Mmm, that's really good. What's it taste like? Um, it's kind of tart, but on a good side. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. What do you pick up, Franklin? Mm. It tastes like honey-ish. Has like an earthy flavor where you can taste all the plants. Yeah. Alright, here goes. Mmm. Mm. It's probably one of the most unique flavors I've ever tasted. It's delicious. It is so good. I highly recommend if you want to be creative in the garden and in the kitchen, make some fresh peony jam, jelly, preserves, whatever you like. Check out these beautiful peonies. A beautiful color of the jelly. Twin Cities Adventures, out.